Hey everyone, welcome to the new part in Attack 3. Great Juju Challenge, and we're just finishing up this part of the level. And yeah, that's pretty much all you gotta do. And I like how he flopped it. Yeah. Yep. So, um, I'm doing the same thing I did last time, which isn't good. I'm recording this at like, let's just say it's about 20 minutes to 2 o'clock in the morning, so. But, um, wasn't getting to sleep, and I figured I, I still gotta finish this. And yeah. In fact, looking at this, the quality is a lot better. I remember, like, okay, I've been recording this at two different times. The last one wasn't all that great, and yeah. The, la the quality in the last video is a little jumpy. And that's something I'm going to fix when I upload the rest of the footage. I only got enough to make a couple of parts so I could narrate them and upload them real quick. Well, I recorded them a couple of days ago, and I still haven't uploaded them yet. I'm going to get them uploaded. Let's see. No, I'm not going to do what I did in the last part. I think it was last part. I was really confusing you guys with the whole time and everything. Um... But no, yeah, we're about done with this, and once we get done, we'll move on to the next area, or next part of this area, and where am I? Oh, okay, I made it. Yeah, that's the thing about the underwater area, sometimes it gets a little disorienting, like, oh, crap, you know, where, where the hell am I, but, you know. I do like the guitar in this level. Although this this is another thing, like Follow me. This level I I'm on my way. I wish that maybe this okay, that if they made this game one year after Tac Two. Oh. I wish maybe they had waited another year or something. Like okay, this came out in I think okay, Tac Two came out oh four, so this had to have come out in uh oh five. I wish they had like had this come out in like oh six or something. Gave it, gave it a year to sit and come up with, actually come up with some new areas rather than recycle some of the same things. And yeah, I, I kept throwing it and you're not supposed to, you're supposed to like drop it and I didn't put that together until after it was actually on there and I'm like, oh wait, I could have just dropped it on there. Oh, nope, that didn't work. Oh my god, there's a cat. Oh well, he can... Hold up there, Dak. Call me he can wait. Okay, you guys can't even hear the meowing, but oh well. Um, but yeah, I think they should have done that because, in my opinion, it really would have worked out better. And they could have, you know, I had a lot more time to think about, you know, ways of, I don't know, just, you know, ways of making the graphics look nicer and bringing a lot. Don't. Move. Bringing newer elements besides the fact oh, that now you can play yeah. as Locke as well, and two per, 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 you know, you can play with two people, and that that's fine, that's great, actually, it's you know pretty cool. But the thing is, I think we they would have gotten a better game if they didn't try to rush it. And yeah, there are parts of this where you can tell, yeah, they they really were rushing this, and that's that's what it feels like. Maybe they weren't. Maybe this was already. Maybe, like, the second game and this game, before the first one were even released, these two were already kind of, you know, the whole process was already starting, I guess. It's not pre-production, that's for film, but, like, you know, pre-development, I guess, would be it. And I don't know, I haven't read that anywhere or anything, this is just kind of, maybe that's what happened, I really don't know, don't think I'm giving you guys facts. But, yeah, um... And I think if they had just waited, that would have made the game a lot better, rather than... So I'm just going, okay, I'm just going to go off the fact that it came out a year after the second game, which was a great game, it's fantastic, I love that game. As you guys can tell, I was going on and on about it in my last walkthrough tattoo. Was it my last? Oh crap, no, 
Crap, Twin Sandy was my last one. Tech 2 was the one before it. But, um... Oh yeah, this is the last time you see the snake guys, too. This is the last time you see several of the enemies. Yeah, um... And then, yeah, uh, this is... This is kind of tricky your first time, because I was getting a little confused. Like, okay, well, wait, where do I go and everything? But then it's... Yeah, well, like, after your first time, it's pretty easy. And... Of course, you know, the question always remains, are we going to get another game? I'm going to be, I just got to be honest with you guys, if we are, it's not going to be anytime soon. It really isn't, and, I mean, if at all, it's not going to be anytime soon, and if we never do, it's not going to surprise me. The whole television show, I think, is really what brought it everything down, and the fact that this game really did not live up to the second game, and that the second game was better than the first game, leading up to the whole thing that, wow, maybe these games are going to get better as they go along, but then this game comes along, and it's like, well, I mean, it, it's not horrible, it's not really even bad, it's just not as good as the second one, or the first one, it's just okay, and that's unfortunate, because there, there's so much they can do with this, I think that if they kind of took it, and gave it more of a serious tone or whatever, I think then they'd, first of all, they'd get a larger audience, and, you know, they'd, they'd be able to, they, they could, okay, the thing about these games is that you can pick any of them up, anyone, you don't need to play them all, um, at once, you know, in order. And, you know, because you won't know what's going on otherwise. No, I mean, each game is its own individual story. So what I'm thinking is maybe they could actually create maybe an actual trilogy thing where each game flows into the next one rather than, you know, and when I say that, I don't mean, like, you know, cliffhanger endings or anything like that. I mean, like, um... Oh, shit! Okay, ooh, about died there. Alright, that was smart. And what the hell? The fire kills me. Anyway... Yes, commit suicide attack, okay. Um, and... Ah, oh, crap, I can't remember what I was saying. Uh, hold on. Take me a second. Um, oh yeah. Like, not end them on a... Oh, you know, we're definitely gonna have a sequel, but like... Okay, wrap it up so that if there are no sequels, it still can exist on its own. And it's still good. But also... Oh, we finished the area. And next is the boss, so I'll kind of wrap this up real quick. But also so that, you know, if there was a sequel, it wouldn't feel unnecessary. It'd be like, you know, there were a few things in the first game that maybe, you know, you could go off on more. And that's the things about these games, is that really, if the sequels didn't exist to the first game, I mean, obviously my favorite video game in the world wouldn't have existed at the same time. Yeah, I mean, the first game could have existed on its own. It would have been great, you know, but then they made the sequels, and that's it, just it. I mean, the second one was great, and then the third one, not that great. So I think if they were to kind of come up with this story arc that they could span into at least two or three games, I think they could bring it back. I really do, and I hope they do. Um, and make it more mature. I mean, not mature as in, like, you know, deadpan serious, but like, you know, like an older audience. Don't have all these fart jokes or, you know, stuff like that. Stuff meant for little kids. Actually have some stuff that, like, people like me can laugh at without feeling like, wow, I need to grow up. And if you laugh at it, that's fine. I don't care. Yeah, I'm not judging you. If you do, okay. Oh, and this is the last time we see those, uh, cat-like rockers and the well, you'll see what else is coming. Uh, ah, the, the ones that take like three hits. Anyway, I'm not saying, oh, you're immature or anything. That's fine if you laugh. I don't care. Great. Good. You know, you're, it's enjoyable for you. And that's fantastic. I think that they could just make it a little more mature. You know, I don't like the jokes like that. I think, you know, they're mature. I think they could do better. Um, and hopefully they'll come back and do something better. Oh yeah, and this is the last time, yeah, and as I said, this is the last time we see these. 
Oh man, here we go. It's the boss. And yeah. So, I guess. Yeah, um. If they did, just more mature and try and think of something that could continuously go on. And each one could work with the next. And we are done with the area. Ah, oh, I didn't even finish an even number like I usually try to do. Alright, well, I guess with all that said, um, I mean, go ahead and leave your opinions down in the comments below, of course, please do that, um, but don't be a douchebag about it. If you don't agree with what I said, then fine, go ahead and say that, but don't be like, oh, you're a freaking idiot, you didn't, you know, you you don't know what you're talking about, don't do that. I do know what I'm talking about, somewhat, kind of, cutscene, I'll finish this up afterwards. Hey, there you are! Yeah, we've been looking all over for you. We've got a present for you. Oh, joy. One, two, seven, Eight, three hundred and twenty-nine. Three! <coughs> now you can really stink. Oh. Great. Alright, I just thought of a great example of a trilogy that really works, and that's the Sly Cooper games, where they're not completely childish or anything. I mean, yeah, they're meant for child, you know, children, y younger kids. But at the same time, like, a, a teenager like myself, you know, 15, 16 years old, or even someone in their early 20s or something, because I can't imagine anyone, like, late in their late 20s did anywhere above that playing. But, like, they could just pick it up and play it, and, you know, have a lot of fun with it, and I died, okay, ran off the edge of it. You know, and each one did continuously flow into the other one, and yet... If they didn't make those sequels, it would have been fine. You know, you wouldn't have had all those questions or anything. Of course, the first one they did end on that cheap thing. That was kind of annoying, but it's like, you know, if they if they hadn't continued it, whatever, it's fine. That's... Oh, and I don't have enough. Anyway, that's what I mean. Something like Sly Cooper, that's what they should do for TAC. And I really think if they were to just... You know, I've had a few years of rest. I think they should just bring it back. And go back to, you know, like, something like the first or second game. More like the second one, where, you know, it had the serious tone, but it was fun. Guys, comment, subscribe, visit my channel, check out JRAS channel. See you guys in the next video. Bye.